What type of music do you play? I play a mixture of sort of upbeat pop, like your Kate Nash and your Lily Allen, um, and sort of like a downbeat folk, like Carol King and Jane Mitchell type of stuff. What music inspired you to become a musician? I don't think there was any sort of particular type of music. I listened to it a lot, but um, what inspired me to become a musician was my guitar teacher when she first played in primary school and was like, I'm going to be doing guitar lessons. So I thought, I want to be you, because she sang in front of us all and it was deaf on. So I was like, that was my point when I wanted to be a musician. It always works, I don't know how. I've heard so many times, you think I'd be used to it by now. What venues would you like to play at in Manchester? Um, if I had all the money in the world and I'd become like famous, as they like to say, um, I'd probably like to play, I wouldn't want to go any bigger than the Apollo. I think the Phones for You Arena or MEM um, is too big unless you're like Pink or Beyonce and put on like a huge show. I like to keep things as small as I can, so I think Apollo would be the biggest I'd go to. But I do like the Academy. I think the academy is just really nice shape to see everything. How has living in Manchester affected your musical career? I think going from Manchester is a good starting block for any musician. Um, but I think there's only so far you can go. There's a lot of um, connections and there's a lot of little groups in Manchester that you can play at. And I think that's helped me develop as a musician and play and get myself forward. What education route did you take within Manchester? I went to Manchester Music Base and um, it's a music college where you start in a band sort of thing and you build yourself up as a musician through there and then once I finished there I just took it upon myself to carry on doing what I'm doing.